We began construction on the Philip H. Ryan Health Science Center in November of 2013, some 14 months ago. The center includes 58,000 square feet of space, classrooms, laboratories, informal group study, and other learning spaces for students. We also have a library resource room, a cafe, and a wellness center for our students. One of our goals here at the Health Science Center was to create a total campus experience for our students, both in the occupational therapy and physician assistant programs. We had an exceptional project team uh, involved in the construction of the Health Science Center here at One Denslow Road, including Michael Crawley of Crawley Associates, who acted as the owner's representative, architect Ben Schenkelberg from Springfield and Green Bay, Wisconsin, who had done many similar projects during his 35-year career in the profession, and general contractor Crocker Builders from Springfield. One of our goals was to use local contractors, and I'm pleased to say that more than 99% of contractors and subcontractors used here at this site were from the local community. The style of the building is contemporary. In our research prior to design, our goal was to create a professional environment as uh, all of our graduate students in this building will be studying in the health science profession. Uh, it is also a building that has lots of natural light as almost every office and classroom uh, has windows. Uh, there's a very contemporary design in the furniture as well. And so students who graduate uh, from this uh, facility will go out into the world uh, with all of the benefits of having worked and studied in a very contemporary atmosphere. Since our students will spend most of their day here studying and sitting in the classroom, the design and selection of the furniture, other design elements on the interior of the building were very carefully considered. The furniture was um, tested by both students, faculty, and staff as we selected uh, various items. And so the furniture is very contemporary looking, uh, yet is also very ergonomically comfortable for students who will be uh, sitting in classrooms for many hours or studying in labs. There was also a green theme in the building, mm -hmm. as we were very energy conscious uh, during construction. And so all of the lighting is LED lighting, highly energy efficient. The heating and cooling system is fired by natural gas which is also very uh, efficient and very clean for the environment. And we also have a lot of natural daylighting, uh, which minimizes the use of electricity during the day. So the building certainly has a very green theme to it, and it will be a highly energy efficient building. The building is designed with a very open feel to it, uh, both in terms of the classrooms, the laboratories, and the group study spaces that we've provided for students. Over the years, we have heard many times from our students that they want places to study, both formally and informally, uh, when they are out of the classroom. And so this building includes eight very spacious group study rooms and many, many informal learning uh, spaces where students can sit either privately or in small groups uh, to get their studying done. We really had a great project team working on the project in terms of the architect, the general contractor, and the interior designer. And uh, we're very pleased with the work of our interior designer, Nancy O'Brien, who's headquartered in Springfield. Uh, we used many natural elements from the New England region, including Vermont slate uh, for our main grand staircase. One of the themes uh, of the building, and really many of the buildings we've worked on over the years, has been to make them as flexible as possible. And so during design, and as we selected furniture, uh, flexibility and modular nature of the furniture was very high on our list. And so you'll find that all of our classrooms are highly flexible, and all of our common areas and group study rooms are flexible in terms of our ability to rearrange furniture in many different configurations to accommodate the need. The building is 100% wireless capable, uh, both inside the buildings and out on our extensive patios uh, that surround the building. Uh, inside the building there are uh, many LCD display panels, uh, both in classrooms, in group study rooms, and in many of the common areas. These display panels uh, can wirelessly link to laptops, 
so that students or professors can display their work. Uh, in the main lobbies, the display panels uh, will broadcast messaging uh, to students uh, on a daily basis. We have uh, 15 computer stations uh, dedicated to common areas within the building that are available to students uh, to use at any time, and those computer stations are obviously hooked up to the internet and are also hooked up to printers that are uh, scattered throughout the building. Each of our classrooms has a um, elaborate AV uh, technology within each classroom uh, capable of displaying any type of uh, visual um, link from a computer. Uh, they have complete audio system. The building sits on 11 acres of land here at the corner of Shaker and Denslow Road in East Long Meadow. In addition to the 58,000 square foot feet of space within the building, uh, we have 350 parking spaces available for students, faculty, and staff. All of the exterior doors to the building are controlled by card access, and we have the ability to manage that card access system anywhere in the world uh, with a website connection. In addition, we have 12 video camera feeds, both on the exterior building and on all of the interior entryways to the building. The property also has three emergency call boxes located uh, in various parking lots. One of the goals uh, that we had during the design phase was to create a wow factor within the building. And we uh, focused on the two common areas within the building to create that wow factor, both the second floor and the first floor common areas. And so that wow factor really involves lighting. And you see some very unique fixtures in this uh, common space, uh, barrel lighting, spiral helix-like uh, lighting strands, and wall sconces. All of the lighting is LED, so it's very energy efficient, but it creates a very dramatic look within the building, and it highlights uh, the various wall finishes uh, that we've placed on the walls, including natural woods and uh, beautiful wall coverings. Bay Path University has experienced incredible growth over the last decade. Our main campus in Longmeadow is fully built out. This new facility at One Denslow Road in East Longmeadow is our response to that rapid growth. Our graduate programs in health sciences are burgeoning, including the degree in occupational therapy and physician assistant studies. We have put a stake in the ground by building this new state-of-the-art facility.